guys, it's France. Welcome to this special edition video, which I'm doing today for the Pen Pastel BNL blog. This is just a quick and easy background technique for which I'm using Pen Pastels, of course, and I'm using it to create a resist for acrylic paint. The first layer is just some modeling paste that I've applied on top of a mask, and now I'm adding a bit of gesso taking care that I have gesso in every little crease created by the modeling paste. Before I can continue, I have to make sure this is absolutely dry, otherwise I will be in trouble with my pen pastels. So I'm colorizing it using just two colors of pen pastels and again I'm making sure that I have color everywhere because this is what will make the next step interesting. I'm flipping my book over and again continue applying pen pastels. I'm working with a soft tool. And now that this is done, I can go in with my acrylic paint. This is an airbrush color by Golden. So I just apply some paint and then spray water to blend it all over the page. I did apply a bit of masking tape to protect the spine of my book so that not everything would be completely colorized in blue. Again, making sure this is thoroughly dried and now the fun can begin. I'm just going over it with a baby wipe and as you can see the paint is coming off again. That's the resist from the pen pastels. The more you rub, the more paint you will take off again. Now, in this uh, art channel, my paper is really heavily textured, so this adds even more interest to the background. Now I can play with some other acrylic paint. I'm adding a bit of... What color is this? This is a Crinacridon Nickel Azul Gold. You'll find a complete list of ingredients on the Pen Pastel blog or on my blog. This time I'm not waiting for it to dry before I'm going over it with my baby wipe because I really only want it to be a very uh, soft shade. Then going back in with the same blue I used in the first place and again rubbing away what I don't want. By adding several layers of color you will add even more depth to your background. That's about it actually, you can play as much as you want, adding paint and taking it back off, as long as your paper can take it. I hope you liked it, see you back next time, ta-da!